climate change poverty health crisis the world is running out of time we are in the grip of a tripartite crisis as we remain oblivious these problems threaten the collapse of our globe from poverty stricken farmers to lifeless rivers the world needs saving the world needs enactus in 2011 enactus miranda house was initiated with the ideal of sustainability at its core as a result we undertook three impassioned projects and this is our journey yamuna lagbhag sukh gayi hai aur delhi mein yamuna ji bhayankar roop se pradushit ho gayi एक टाइम ऐसा था हम इसके पानी से खाना भी बनाते थे पीते भी थे और अब तो हाथ गिरने का भी मन नहीं करता है रिवर यमुना द लाइफ लाइन ऑफ दिल्ली ऑफ इन वर्शिप्ड एज अ गॉड इन इंडिया हैज नाउ बीन डिक्लेयर इकोलॉजिकली डेड बाय द यूनाइटेड नेशंस नियरली 57 मिलियन पीपल आर ड्रास्टिकली अफेक्टेड बाय इट्स डिटोरियरेटिंग कंडीशन ह्यूमन एक्टिविटीज लाइक लिडरिंग bathing disposal of industrial waste and idle immersion led to the contamination of the river water once a pride and glory of the country now choked by a thick cloak of water hyacinth yamuna is pleading to breathe water hyacinth is listed as world's worst water weed by the united nations environment program the river yamuna has been blanketed by a dense spread of this invasive menace this poses a three fold problem of water pollution threat to aquatic life and worsening of the living conditions of the river bank residents with a vision to transform challenges into opportunities an actress miranda house initiated project ikhtiar in 2017 bound by the motto of eradication through utilization we tapped on the latent potential of water hyacinths to quell the hazards they pose Project Ikhtiar identified an urban slum in Lok Kalyan Setu near ITO Ghat where an overgrowth of hyacinths was observed. The members of the community are street vendors and daily wage earners who have no access to clean water. We resolved to tackle these obstacles and uplift the livelihood of the community. Project Ikhtiar produces manure utilizing water hyacinths as the central component along with the biodegradable waste. After extraction the weeds are chopped and left to decompose in a customized composting box for 45 to 60 days. A well developed root system enables the absorption of important nutrients making the manure pathogen free and allowing percolation of air and water. Packaged in eco-friendly jute bags this manure is sold to several nurseries schools and colleges across Delhi and CR. section of our project the community has produced 12 batches of manure which amounts to 2976 kg the total revenue of our community has surged from rupees 16800 to rupees 53250 hence there has been an upswing of 216.96% in the aggregate revenue of the project and a rise of 240.92% in the individual income of the members through the extraction of 4456 kg of hyacinth along with reuse of 348 kg of biodegradable waste there has been a reduction of carbon footprint by 0.77 metric tons river surface cleaning has reduced the breeding of vectors and rejuvenated aquatic life Project Ikhtiar has been impacting lives by initiating a social transformation. Yes, the local youth have gone and put it in their hands, put it in their hands, put it in their hands, and put it in their hands. We have collaborated with several NGOs to organize awareness workshops. Our project has conducted collection and distribution drives of essential items for the benefit of the community. We have impacted more than 34 members directly and 25384 members indirectly. Project Ikhtiar has also been recognized by the esteemed daily The Times of India. Our project is dedicated towards building a better future and fulfills five sustainable development goals set up by the United Nations. In the light of COVID-19, we have contacted NGOs like Robin Hood Army to help us reach out to the community and provide them with required protection gear. 
With the help of the district magistrate, the team was able to guide the members to local food distribution centers. We plan to hold workshops for the community to equip them with newer skills to cope with the crisis. Further, we aim to resort to sales through e-commerce platforms like India Mart. For improved quality, the project will make use of temperature-controlled composting bins. Our goal also lies in exploring the possibilities of manufacturing biogas as an alternative to natural gas. One batch at a time, one family at a time, one community at a time. Change takes place. Such is the transformative power of Project Iktiar.